It doesn't happen every year, but on certain years when we have the correct fall weather, we end up getting a pest that looks like a slimy little slug, and it's called a pear slug, but it's actually the larva of a sawfly that's native to Wyoming. The sawfly likes to lay its eggs on members of the rose family, and any of our fruit trees, uh, specifically the pear, are susceptible to the feeding of the pear slug and basically they turn the, the surface of the leaf into a liquid and then they slurp up that syrupy slime and they leave the leaf looking pretty much skeletonized and eventually they will pupate and hatch in the springtime and then we have the adults back in the environment to lay eggs the following year. Usually a hot dry summer is one that will lead to the pear slug damage and a lot of times people will think that they've got drought or sun scald damage on the leaves and eventually if you look hard enough, you can find the, the pear slug larva crawling around on the leaves. And one of the best ways to get rid of them is a chemical free method. All you need is a jet setting on one of your garden sprinklers that goes at the end of your garden hose. And then you can just spray the larva off of the foliage on the plants. So it's a great way to get rid of those pests in the garden without using a chemical. For the University of Wyoming Extension, I'm Donna Hoffman, and you're watching From the Ground Up.